Elvis is in the house. 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 Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, Elvis. You are by far one of the best. Elvis is one of the best. He's very good dog. I went to groom him today. <laughs> oh, man, I have some tough ones. Have ya? I don't know. Okay, so when Trina walks in, uh, you come grab Elvis for a minute. Or here, real fast, get on that side, grab a second brush, and then he can go straight to the bath. Ooh, what's that? If me and you can brush real fast, Trina. Go. Hustle, bustle, hustle, bustle. Teamwork, buddy. Teamwork, buddy. We're double teaming you, Elvis. Tag team. Tag team in the holes. Okay, I'll be back. Okay. okay. In a bit. We got this. Okay, I'll be back. Is she man? I don't, I don't think so. His hair is just interestingly. Easy manageable to work with. Be right with you, Trina. What you doing, girl? Does it does it help to come in a little earlier? Yeah. Great. Really? You think so? What is it? Two months? Are they? Your husband had a seizure. Yeah. How are you remembering that, man? I guess you can't forget it, huh? Was it tough? Uh, been in the oh, I didn't know. He's been in the hospital? Yeah. Is he outside with you now? No, he's not. Yeah, he's home. Now. He's home? Okay, he's not here. Oh. How was it? How'd it go? Um, kind of scary. But kind of scary? Yeah. Resolved. The, the medicine that they had on for 40 years, uh, he reached the toxicity level of his body. So his body wasn't absorbing it. They have to switch and, yeah. yeah, I'm sorry to hear that, girl. Watch your fingers, bro. I'm going to brush your thumb. I'm going to brush your... I didn't cut your thumb. Don't be saying things like that out loud, man. Big body. I'm already done. You have to go to the bath. Okay, let's go to the bath. You're slow. I already did it myself. You're over here messing around. I don't know... I don't know where you learned to brush. I didn't learn. That's the thing. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Stupid. Hasta luego, baby. It's like in, that, bro. Now. It's like that, bro. Hasta luego. It's like that, bro. All right, Trina, give me about two seconds here. Let's see what's. Let me do a little something, something here. A little spray, spray. David Torres, were you, were, did, David, David Torres, you guys are the best. David, don't hurt your, yourself. <laughs> Thank you, David Torres. All right, Trina, come on back, girl. So Trina had a 130, and I said, hey, you know, it's a nail trim, and we're moving pretty quickly, and go ahead and just come on in. Good dog, two bucks. I don't think we use the groom loop here. I think mama just holds. Let me switch out the 40 blade. You okay, girl? You know, he's just making my life hard. Do you need help? No, I'm not. Okay, okay. You don't, you're not taping or anything, are you? Yeah, we're alive right now. Is oh, that okay. okay? You want me to face the camera differently today? No, I just don't want to. I'm not. I don't, I don't mind. Way. Okay, she's not in camera. I'm going to go down and just focus on the feet. You got it. Okay. All right. Which way does he need to face? Just fine. Just here. But is this your strong arm? Yeah. Okay. Today it Good is. hold. Yep. Good hold there. 
Right. And this one under. Over. 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 That's right. There you go. Perfect. It's been a yeah. big love. Big love hug there, bub. The big love hug. Boy. Please be a good boy. You just need to get this done. Because they hurt. They scratch me. Oh, how have you been, Dee Dee? You know? Good? I think I've been doing pretty good. That's good. My arm has been really, but my the back right here, because uh -huh. I'm doing this all day, every right. day, and then I don't take a break usually, so I think it's just taking its toll. Mm. And uh, I need a deep massage, like something I don't know. I plan on trying to get it done, but you know how it is. Yeah, trying to peel off and actually go do it. Right. Hopefully, it'll help. But it tells me I'm getting older. I tell you what. <laughs> It's like, dang, girl, you can't you can't do back to back without a rest in your muscle. I have to go Monday to have my hands looked at. Both of them. Careful. Just careful. numb a lot. Hey, 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 hey. I got you. I got you. You're good. You're good, buddy. Ugh. You're good, buddy. No, no. Don't look at me like that. Okay. Sorry. You're good. I'm no, really lean forward good. a little bit, just not a lot. There you go. There okay. you go. Good. Okay. You okay? Here we go. Yeah. Careful on the table here. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah. Let me see. Okay, hey, stay. Hey, hey. Stay. You just want to get your footing. He's like, no, I want to jump off. Well, that's not gonna happen. Here we I'm go. Sorry. Here we go. Let's focus on what's going on here. These wires are not in a good place, man. Do I need to move okay. him? Hold on, let me see. I could turn them around. Yeah, let's go ahead and turn them around. You think they're tall enough I can reach, but he's doing this whole yeah. Okay. Last one. Okay. Well, so you guys don't have to look at my bra. Looking all up in my armpit and stuff, you know. Yeah. That ain't teaching you nothing. Be a good boy, please. So when it rains, oh, dogs don't love it. Right. So, you know, they don't love it when it rains. Good to go. Good to go. All done. All done. Good to go. Oh, yeah, buddy. Let me go up to this. Good to go. Ugh. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate you. Are we um are we set up for no, we not yet? To. We need to. Okay, I just want to make sure. No, I don't, I might not do it right this second. Okay. Don't keep it that hey, way. don't. Hey, everyone wants to pee this morning. No, no, don't pee there. No, no. It's a natural thing. I understand that. No peeing. Thank you so much. Merry Christmas, girl. I'll text you to the appointment. Okay. Thank you. Merry Christmas, girl. <laughs> Hello, this is Dee Dee with My Favorite Groomer. How can I help you? Yes. Uh huh, yep. You got a bunch of stuff you wanted to sell and all that. I remember. Uh huh. It, and by the way, we're on live uh, video right now, so your conversation is a little bit recorded. People can hear. So if you want to talk later, we, we can kind of talk later. If you want to do a referral, if you want to do a referral plan, I would love to take your referrals. And if you need a kickback, I would love to give you a kickback. Well, actually, my customers want me to groom the dog. Okay. And I was wondering, I've been trying to find out a location that will let me groom the dog. Okay. 
and I don't have the money to set up a new shop and put the drains in for the city ordinance for uh -huh. the water. Okay. And I have customers that uh, cannot pay the prices you're quoting on your website for dogs. I do some dogs that uh, great care of these, and I do them for $65 a piece. Okay. But I'd be willing to give you a little bit of my money in lieu of, you know what I'm saying, for the water and the electricity. Mm -hmm. And I bring my own tools and my own tables and everything down there. I see. So one thing that we can talk offline about is just a rental contract. The only downfall is that what I've seen is a lot of people are not trustworthy in the sense of I'm very strict. So what I mean by strict is that I'm not going to have a dog in here being groomed by a, a renter uh, that's not current on vaccinations. That's just not going to happen. Right, right, right. And I don't mean, so I don't mean like I would have to be in charge of uh, still allowing me to see files where I can, I don't care about your client's information. I'm not here for that. Obviously you're calling me. Right, right. So I, I'm able well, to look and see vaccinations are good to go. And it isn't just a conversation with an owner. It is, I have, I have called the veterinarian. And we have it on record. You know what I'm saying? Because I've got, a, I've got one customer who cannot have the board of tell up because she's allergic to the vaccine. Sure. There's going to be some open windows like that, but there needs to be a, I have personally on my clients with those kinds of waivers, I call it a waiver. Cause if that dog comes in with kennel cough and he spreads it to somebody else, that client's going to yeah. pay for it. So the waiver, the waiver is, I'm going to explain to you what we're looking for. If your dog is wheezing and coughing, you can't come in. You have to cancel the appointment because then, you know, so I hate to sound so strict, but since you're asking me some of the, I, I would allow that. I would actually, I would, I would allow a rental situation to happen. So we can talk about that more. I just need to. I've got, I've got customers. Okay. I've got customers that use some of the groomers there in terms and they said, Cindy, you're not a, you're five times better than any of the groomers that we've taken our dogs to. Okay. And after they saw the thing about Pet Front Petco losing over 80 dogs in the last 10 years. Right. That really spooked a lot of my customers to take their dogs to Pet Smart Petco. Sure. Now, Pet Smart Petco want me to go to work for them, but I don't want to work in an environment where the customer sees me grooming their dog. Okay. I like I like the customer being gone, so I have the dog full attention. And he's paying attention to what I'm asking of him or her. Okay. Because when you have an open situation like Park and Bubbles, they have theirs open to the public coming in. Uh-huh. And I, I don't know how you groom a dog the owner standing there and get the dog to behave. Yeah, I don't know. You have yeah. to watch some of my videos. I'm not sure. I do a lot of uh, grooming with the owner here, so. Well, yeah. But now, where I was working, we were required to carry a million-dollar liability policy, and that's another thing. And then, the, you know, the rent's not the issue of me not getting the building. The issue is getting it set up and getting it approved. All of it. Well, all of it. And then the fees that come with that, you know? Right. And I'm also to a point where I'm so tired of all these Google calls. And update your head, you know, uh, website. Right, right. And I'm getting, I am getting 60 plus calls a week. And all different numbers. And I blocked them and blocked them and blocked them and blocked them. And they're right. still coming through. Yeah, that's that's Google's business. So that's what they got to do. They stay in alive themselves is kind of get that ad going. Well, this is not even Google. These are Google partners and they're, they're, they're scam artists. Right. Because I've talked to Google. Right. Okay. Well, let's, uh, let's, I've got to wrap it up. I'm sorry. If you're interested in renting, yeah. we can talk numbers later. Uh, can, okay. If you're, if you're interested, uh, I know you've been, yes. you've been in business longer than me. You're doing your own thing. I'd hate for you to come in here. And then we have where we butt heads. I just have rules that I'm going to abide by. If you're okay with some of those rules, then we yes. can just, we can definitely press forward and we can go from there. Okay. I'm not looking to make my business a huge business. I'm just trying to make some money to, you know, put me into retirement because I'm not in a situation. I'm 62 years old. 
and I've been doing this 41 years, and I love what I do, but... Uh, I'll be right with you, you folks. Okay, I'm listening. Uh, well, give me a holler back. You got my number. Uh, what I need from you, will you text me the amount of dogs you plan on doing? I don't have, I don't, I don't text. Okay. I need a compilation of how many dogs you plan on doing, whether you want to compile that and talk on the phone or give that to me so I can make work numbers on what is a, what is a probably, fair rate. Uh, it's probably less than 15 dogs a month. Less than 15 dogs a month. Right. How many days a week? It, probably a couple of days a week. A couple of days a week, 15 dogs a month. A couple of days yeah. a week uh, during what time frames? Uh, probably between 8 and noon. From eight to noon, two days a week. Yeah. Okay. Let me let me look at the schedule and see if that's something we can do, and then I will get back with you. Okay. Alrighty. Thanks okay. for calling. Bye. Bye. Uh -huh. Bye. Bye. All right. Hold on. Let me save this number here. Groomer new. Uh, Rent, maybe, question mark. I have no idea what to save that for. So I'm not mad. I'm very serious. And what I hear, and I've already talked to her actually a couple to, a couple times before. She actually called to try to sell me a bunch of used tables at extreme prices. And uh, I just, I can't tell you. I was like, no, I'm good, man. I don't need, you know what I mean? Like, you saved her number? Or I saved her number before, too. That's why I was like, this is a new number, same person. I'm not mad. I'm very serious and I'm very direct about you want to rent your, you want to rent a table in my salon, but you want to be able to groom whatever, you know, no. When you take an old school groomer, she said, what, 40 years. She's not had her own place yet. She's got her own clients yet. Those clients have been going to Petco and PetSmart. The, the story, do you see the storyline? So listen closely to details that are told to you. So the clients are like, you're the best groomer out there. Why Why are we going to PetSmart and Petco? Where, something's happening here. So you look at like the person you're about to open your salon up to. Inconsistent. Inconsistent. Drugs, something like that. drugs? I don't know about drugs. I'm just saying like uh, the storyline doesn't fit all that well. And I've already spent, one time I spent over an hour talking to her. So at that point, you realize who you're talking to and you're like, I need to cut to the to the chase here. And in my opinion, when you're when you're doing that, you should always say, hey, Didi, are you busy? Can I talk to you right now? You should always start off doing that because I would be like, no, I am busy. Let's talk later. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what you're doing you on the other side of that phone. Hey, Didi, are you busy? That's what I do. I say, hey, hey, Connie, are you busy right now? Are you able to talk or do you need to call me back later? Because I don't know what she's doing. She's cooking dinner or whatever, you know. Okay. It got this. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. So always say, hey, hey, Monica, thanks for calling. I appreciate you. Are you busy right now to chit chat? That's the first thing I like to say. The answer is going to be yes. I have time to talk right now. Or, hey, you know what? I got a dog on the table right now. We're live streaming on YouTube. Can I call you back? Okay. No, no, blah, blah, blah. You know, all that. No, you know, things like that. I'm not mad. I'm serious, man. Someone wants to. You know, the problem I had, we had this discussion before and I got off the phone with her and talked to David. I said, I have some rules that every other groomer does not have. I mean, I have some real rules and that sets me really apart. So then two days a week from eight to 12, I have my salon rented out to some, not the whole salon, but like a, an area and I have to share my tub. If she had do dogs come in with fleas, what what then? And then I have my dogs. Uh -uh, no. So there's got to be a contract, an agreement, you know. And so is, then you look at it. Is it worth it? If you can't see eye to eye, is it worth it? Mm -hmm. If you want to have clients like that, she doesn't want to do the city thing. She doesn't want to get the, it, there's a lot to making a business, okay? She doesn't want to get the city permit. She doesn't want to get the inspection. Every year you got to have the fire department come out and inspect. And you got to get your fire extinguisher inspected. That's about 50 bucks. Here, David, if you want. Um, it costs money to have a business. And there's fees every year. Insurance. 
she probably doesn't isn't isn't and doesn't going to get insurance for herself as a groomer, which would be a requirement. You no, I don't think I'm going to do it. <laughs> it's like renting a place. If I if you rent someone's a uh, look at him. If you rent someone's salon, uh, excuse me. If you rent. It, it, here's the real estate stuff. If you rent a business location, renting, not owning, you lifting your tail to help me. You're so smart. Then there's, there's usually an insurance requirement to have such and such amount of insurance. And there's no if, and, but you have to get it and you have to prove it. You have to show your boss, your landlord, the document. Uh, I have to submit it that I am insured to cover everything in my building and myself, that kind of thing, in case I, you know, cause a fire or something. So if she were to rent from me, that's a requirement too. She's got to, she's got to get insurance on her workmanship. She comes in here and nicks a dog. Who's, who's going to be that? Who's going to, uh -uh. this could be a bad situation. And uh, there's this thing called, you know, then when I said old school groomer, old school groomer, someone that's been grooming for themselves for so long, they usually don't want to get someone else younger than them telling them what to do. That's just reality. We call callers like that gabbers in rescue. Really? What kind of dog is it for, David? 32 inch if it's a small dog, the 30, 32 inch one. What breed? Yeah. The one I'm using right now is a 30, 32 inch one. It comes between 30 and 32 inches. Nothing's ever perfect. How, how tall is the groomer? She, she might need a table riser because I'm 5'4". Tell him I need a table riser if I'm 5'4". It'll be helpful. Yeah, get the table risers. Dee Dee recommends the table risers. That's I have them on. My, see, these are table risers on here. Table risers. I'm 5'4". If you guys have bought a table from me, comment. The table risers are definitely handy if you're about 5'4", five, 5'5", five, five, like that, 5'6", five, maybe. 5'7", five, 5'8", five, you, you might not need the table risers. You could always order them later, you know. He's on the phone right now. Pretty dog, yeah. We'll ship it. We'll ship it, but it doesn't doesn't mean they get it the next day, David. It's not, no, you said, said next ship, day. I said ship. We'll ship the next day. Or, okay. Okay. All right. So, mom's gonna come back. I think I'm gonna do the face first because of that. Let me get the face out of the way here. We do seven on the head. Yeah. Seven short on the head here. What do you guys think? Do you guys think I should rent out a booth in my salon to someone that has 40 years experience based off the story she told me? Um, what do you guys think? Yes or no? Yes or no? It my opinion is risky, man. It is risky, but I'm asking their opinion. It, it's it's you just don't want to cause a relationship that you already have a feeling like I don't think it's I think it's too much to ask you to do this for what 50 bucks a month you know what I'm saying an extra 50 bucks a month but to rent that out and, and make sure all these requirements are met that's it too much huh you, you have to charge stay. like two or three no what I'm week. saying is like she wants to do two days a week four hours a day 15 dogs a month uh, so that should be 
she won't. She, if she's trying to save money, she's not going to like my rent. She's not going to like the way I, I, I set it up. Yeah. If she's trying to be cheap about it, she's not going to like. She's not going to like it because I'm not going to be cheap, cheap because it's my time and I'm not. And then I have to give her a key. Oh, hell no. I actually don't have to give her a key. I don't have to give her a key. It could be part of the contract. She has to groom only on days we're here. But then, you know, I don't know. It just seems like too much right there. I'm already spending too much time worrying about it. Yeah, I don't think she's licensed. And neither, I don't have a license, license. I've been through PetSmart training, but I don't have a license. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, you don't have to be a licensed groomer, licensed to be good at it. But I wouldn't be claiming her as my favorite groomer, groomer. She would be running her own business with just renting a space. Well, that doesn't matter. How much, how much does a dog weigh? How much does a dog weigh? Definitely for the toy Yorkie would be the dog of meaning. Oh yeah. And maybe not mini. even that. So it, well, I don't know. That one little mini one is her mini might be a yeah, different yeah. definition. They both kind of look like they both look like a bone, but there's one that's metal and then the other one's gray, like gray. Rubber, rubber plastic. Rubber coating. Yeah, rubber silicone coating. But the small dog up center would probably like barely fit. No. Like no. Get a measurement. Yeah, you would get no, a measurement. No, we're not doing that. You don't, no. So it would be like, you would no, get a measurement. Area from five point seven five inches. Just below to the goal. Refer back to the website, please. I don't like, I don't like the guessing game. Don't guess on the measurement on that. Get on, pull it up. My site, my idea of mini could be completely a different idea of mini to you. I have people come in. I have a miniature poodle, and that dog stands up like a 17 foot. And I'm like, this is not a mini. Uh -uh. Get measurements. Measurements don't lie, right? Donate if you support the channel. Donate, please. Donate, smash the like button. 99 viewers, 37 likes. We're kind of behind on this feed. Look at him. He's such a good boy, man. Smash the like button. Do a little donating if you feel like you're happy. You want us to be on live more often. And she was very against clients watching the room, right? Did you hear that? She was like, I don't want... And so I started thinking... We record every, there's, rec there's cameras all up in here. So I, I forgot to mention that. I said, well, I have everything on film. So if you don't want something on film or something to be seen right there, you're not going to be able to groom here because I'm going to be watching you. <laughs> Red flags all up in that. Oh yeah, really? Yeah. She says, and I don't know how you do it, but I'm not going to groom any dogs in front of their owner. I don't know. I don't want anyone seeing what I'm doing. Yeah, she said that, and everyone heard it. Yeah. Wake up. And then her client says she's the best. I just got to say, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's, whoa, whoa, whoa. The clients don't even get to see what's going on. Wake up. Yes, I did. I said it was a recorded conversation. In the state of Texas, it don't matter anyway. Not in the state of Texas. Check your own states, please. And go back and look at the law. I'm not the law.
Down, 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 down. Good, Elvis. Good, Elvis. Just adore you. Just adore you. So if if, uh, if Nancy's watching this, if you're watching this, Nancy, I would, if this was a, a dog that someone was like, Didi, I want to breed him, I would be like, amazing demeanor. De amazing. I would love to see that dog multiply. You know what I'm saying? I would love it. Kind, sweet, generous, loving, not wild, tameable, trainable, obedient. People just out there breeding all kinds of dogs just to have puppies. Don't pick and choose best qualities, man. What's that? I wonder if I could catch it on live. I can't, I don't know. I can't remember. Boom, Lord. Boom. 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 I got hair in my mask. This mask got to go home tonight. Can someone block David Lewis Browning? Thank you. Boom, shakalaka. Boom. Look at that face. Are, oh, did you get him out? Yeah. Obviously. He always has really bad ones, don't he? So that could be a breeder for oh, yeah, that's true. The eye booger situation, but you know, a human can fix it. So that's the only a thing a human would, can help fix that issue. So that's the only thing you would consider if you were to breed him. Right. Yep. I'm getting hungry. We hungry means I start to slow down, man. I can feel my body just slowing down. Getting a little hungry. Quit moving around, sweetie. Camera's messing up, huh? See, that helps. Don't. This is if you want to use thinning shears, you could use it in this in place of the scissors I'm using. The same thing, more swipes. Thinning, blending. We did a seven blade on the top of the head, believe it or not. Kind of went that way with it and then that way. Come on, let me see. Let me see. Good. Inverted V. And take take out any of those like that inverted V.
you guys happy, smash the like button. If you're happy, smash the like button. If you're happy, smash the like button. <laughs> if you're happy, smash the like button. <laughs> Smash the like button. If you're happy, smash the like button. If you're happy, smash the like button. If you're happy, smash the like button. I should start singing that. Sounds stupid. Stupid. If you're happy, smash the like button. Not hot, guys. What's not hot? The cam. Then it's not hot? Yeah. Why someone said it was hot, maybe? Yeah, it keeps like. like it's a, a different kind of camera, man. It's probably the. I, I want to say it's the internet because it's not losing the, 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 the screen. It's actually just losing like the broadcast. You guys know what I'm What's saying? What's up, baby doll? What's up, baby doll? Hmm? If it was the camera, it would like flicker off and on. It's not flickering off and on. It's the image quality. So that's like bandwidth type stuff. If it disconnects, we won't be back. We'll see you on gaming tonight. So I'm officially a technician now. <laughs> a certified tech. Certified, certified technician. Te certified technician. I got another thing under my belt. Whoop, whoop. If you want these scissors, these, these are super inex groomer on them. They're at myfavoritegroomer.com under shears called My Favorite Groomer Shears. They're super affordable. And I don't have them loaded yet, all yet. I have them all laying over there. They're all not even loaded. I got some cute small face ones that are blue. I can't wait, man. I cannot wait to show you guys. Things just keep on growing over here. We just reinvest right back into the business, you guys. Your support allows us to reinvest. That mommy? You guys, we don't sell the one I was wearing, but we do sell this better one. But the one he's wearing mm -hmm. is old, old school. I would style this one, but I don't want to pay for it. I don't want to pay for it. Later, we'll upgrade. Because we the blue, two. does the blue one still work? We have two working good ones. But that yeah. one, you know what I love is I can just go boom and it's Velcro. Yeah, like boom, it's Velcro. It's Velcro. The other one I've got to tie the way around. Hey, buddy. This one matches my skin tone. So you guys know what I'm mean. Shut up. What the heck does that mean anyway? I'm nice. He's like a show dog, what do you say? Really? Yeah. Did you guys it's see when so he was mad at that last room? Did you see how mad he was? Big difference when we're not mad at, you know? Huge, huge difference when we don't have tangles. We did. Is it month, every month or two months? I think it's every two months, actually. See if that helps. Let's hear some.
Can you please order another cord like that just in case it's because me and you both stepped on it like three times today? I didn't step yes, on you it. Did. I saw. I saw. No, I didn't. Did you have you been stepping on it? Oh, look at the eyeballs on my face. You've been stepping on it, man. That's probably why, you guys. You stepped on the wire. It's probably broke it. David, I saw you step on it a lot. You're not supposed to step on it, girl. You put it right. It's your fault. It's your fault because you're the only other person in here for me to blame. So uh, this is for the haters. This is me shaving a dog, right? <laughs> I shave every dog, right? No, inaccurate. Inaccurate. Oh, that curl, the hair comes down and curls up. It's pretty cute, man. How many guys out there watching have the <laughs> Didi did it? How many guys out there say if you have a dog upstand, small, large, or mini? Do, do you guys have a small, large, or mini dog upstand in your care? How many of you guys have a small, large, or mini dog upstand? Write down mini, small, or large. Who out there has a small? So do that hashtag too. Do hashtag dog up stand small, hashtag, oh no, yeah. Hashtag dog up mini or hashtag dog up stand large. How many of you guys have the dog up stand product? Small, large, mini. Who has it? You can come behind me now if you want, guys. I just need to get over here. It's probably me, dude. I probably stepped on that. I'm telling you, it probably is me. Probably did step on it. Trying to blow on the wire, see if it helps any. Just like you, you guys remember when you had to blow on the Nintendo 64s? You probably, you probably don't know anything about that. Exactly, the too. shape or brush, man. I cannot do a groom without it. I tell you what, it's just real nice and light. The hair in your... you're not trying to brush the hair, you're trying to move it around. Why wouldn't you want to spend a little time making this? Just gorgeous, right? Such a good dog. You have a good groom dog, you can really spend some time and just not wasted time. And still be ahead of schedule. So it's only 12 something, right? 
He only just got here 1130. See what I'm saying? You got a good dog. It's fast. Why keep him for five, six hours? Same yeah. Up here. That sounded all messed up. He's like, hello? Hello? What can I do for you, man? This is a double uh, call, triple sorry. call. Uh, order, what do you mean? What are you sounding like that for? What do you mean? Who talks to someone like that? <laughs> what do you mean? He says. Oh, the dog upstand? Okay. That's two dog upstand calls today, man. We do it online? Oh, did you already purchase it? So the dog up stand's going to be purchased directly from the dog up stand site. We can help her, but um, it does go through the dog up stand website. And then the other one will be my We're two different locations. It's going to ship out of her, made and sold in Virginia. Tell her that. That's he doesn't know, but they're on my favorite groomer. It's just. So you want to make sure you measure first. Yeah, you want to make sure you measure first. Measure. Take the time to measure. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Like I'm gonna go. Is that our fault? I can't. It's not going to be like that. I may be able to do it, but uh, this year Walmart changed their return policy. I can tell you that's costing them a lot of money. How long until Amazon can't do it? No, I ever? don't think Amazon might not ever. That's because of the requirements they require the vendor to fill. It's on the vendor. If you want to sell at Amazon, you got to read their contract. And maybe Amazon doesn't even take the hit for that. I don't know. Uh, it's been a minute since I'm on track. You guys, I don't know, man. But if I was a business, which I am, returns are the biggest loss. Yeah, because you lose shame. About returns. I'm a returner person, you know, and I understand it. It's like sometimes you just went broke overnight or feel guilty about the purchase or you wish you didn't buy something. That's an that we know that you can't do returns, then you won't buy it, will you? You'll step back and go, do I really want to buy this? Do I really need this right now? Do I need another chapstick? Bro, our Wi-Fi is the best internet out there. We just upgraded the Wi-Fi. And the camera's not no cheap camera. The camera's like a $800 camera, man. Something's going on right now. Probably because I stepped on that cord, bro. The cheapest things here are probably the cords. But we haven't had this problem They're before. like, you need better Wi-Fi and a better camera. Well, you'd miss all the other live feeds. Because we just upgraded our internet. Um... What live feed was that? Perla. We did it. Um, was it Perla? Who was the influencer on upgrading our internet that day? I don't know. I don't know, but we upgraded that day alive. You were on the phone for what? Three hours with them? I'm thinking it's like, a, it's. it seems like it's some type of interference with the wires or something. I'm telling you what it is. Okay, it's we something. can quit. Do you guys want us to quit the feed right now? Because we will. One, two... Three, four, I need a yes, no answer. You guys want to quit the live feed? Because, I mean, we could just take offline then. Simply just need, like, a restore or something. Keep messing with your foot. We can just totally go offline. Right, Jason? Is Jason still out there? They said no. I'll go if you guys if if we've got too many complaints we'll just go I'll just Dang, disconnect. Everybody said no. <laughs> I will disconnect if we cannot move on. We can tech always happen in some way or some fashion. It's just we happen to have them more than other people because we're not we're 
we don't have staffing like a news channel. Yeah, man, we don't. And matter of fact, we we found out why we keep crashing on the gaming is because no one else is gaming two people all all the time. We're always gaming two people. That's a lot of stuff happening in the air. I'm telling you, get the new cord. Get a new replacement cord. Get I think I stepped cord, on it man. three times. Where's the glitch? When I look up there, it looks fine. Not, that's what I'm saying. It's not the glitch on there. That's why I'm Wait. saying. Oh, our glitch is not happening. It's, it's fine? It's, it's something to do with the internet because it's not happening uh, up there. May, they could be working on something with the internet right now. Plus, plus it's um, it's, it's like it's, it's lagging to have the picture. So that means it's something to do with bandwidth. We shouldn't be having bandwidth problems. Because Not at the rate I'm paying. Exactly. The bill's 300 and something dollars. When I just looked at like it that yesterday. Happens, that means the internet can't produce the picture. The new bill for internet is over $300. That's disgusting to That's me. That's I know. It's not internet. It's disgusting, man. No, it's not the, the camera. It's the internet or something. I don't know. It could probably reset. How many modems does it have? Like five? What? What are you talking about? We have like five modems just to run the Wi-Fi, man. Stupid! <laughs> it's not for just the Wi-Fi day. I want the hotspot. What you requested? Hello. It was free, man. Did you? No. Mm -mm. Come on now, Elvis. We're just about done here. This is my ear shear. It's pointy and straight. I, I use it on all the ears. So you're such a good boy. David, do you have my cell phone? No. There you go. Appreciate you. Yeah. It's so pretty. You're so birdie. Yes, you are. Let me do this. Just tried to get a snack and my bird bit me. <laughs> you can close mom out, David. I don't believe I have the file pulled. You'll have to go pull the file. Or not, that's fine. I'm almost done anyway. Okay. It's going to be harder to explain to you how to pull the file. So awesome. Yeah? You like it? Yeah. Sweet. Let's see here. I like his hair. He's already looking up. 
Pimp, pimp, skills, pimp, pimp. <laughs> Such a different place when he's uh, not mad at me. It's just he is, right? Amazing. Amazing animal. Elvis, say hi to the camera. Yo, are you doing check today? Yeah. I'll okay, perfect. Do you ever know that Bath and Body Works? Yes. We actually have try to go when they have any sales. They have a huge sale today. <laughs> Boy, they I have love these guys. Yeah. This is where you're going to be today. Oh, rooming only, yeah? Rooming only, no food or anything. Yeah. No, I these these are my, my favorite. Great. My favorites is Did you sell today? Yes. <laughs> we went to two days in a row. They did that sale a couple, like a month ago, maybe like uh, two weeks ago or something like that. They did uh, all the body wash, this and it that. It is chicks. Do dogs even have yeah, cheeks? Technically, really? this is like a. Again? They no, just did man. It. I don't think they have cheeks yeah. back here. Two Are weeks, man. Cheeks? Well, I got some for gifts. Cool. You can't beat that one. Like buy one get one free, basically, or something so oh, cheap. Got, two bucks a bottle. Or I got six. Where do you think the, the dog cheeks $9. are here? Like where wow. the where the yes. kind of where the mouth ends right here, way back here. Wait, what are you guys talking about? <laughs> about dog cheeks. Dog cheeks. They don't have yeah. cheeks really. Under the eyes? Are you serious? They're really bony. That's what I'm saying. Like I don't think dogs really have bony. cheeks. Like. This is a jaw, right here's a jaw, and then right here's like the mouth, the mouth extends past the cheek, so I don't know. If I were to shave that face, it would be very, very bony, that one, just like Saki's, it would be yeah. like Saki's, like a chihuahua's okay. face. Yeah. Look at his awesome ears, you guys, it's like, so cool. Boing, 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 boing. <laughs> yeah, I think we're, this is our last one for the year that's set up. Yeah, we need to set Okay, I'm going to email you, okay? You don't, yeah, uh, every two months on okay. Saturday. What kind of sale is that? Oh. I got the lotion that's $2.95 or $2.99. Oh my like they need to quit, man. They need to quit trying to break people down. I don't know if it's a candle, too, but my daughter left that twisted peppermint. So Gosh. I have three bottles of that. I'm going to have some gifts to her for her birthday Friday. You can't beat it. No, you can't. I mean, they're going to be money at $2.95. You need to stock up her present to your ground when they do yeah, that. Exactly. You know what I mean? Maybe they call them ghosts. I'll email you. I'm going to do everyone at once on the ears. Saturday I love schedule. Of them. Okay. Cause there's a few of you that only do Saturday. So yeah. let me those email those ears to you. Are adorable. Okay, I can't do the 19th of His ears were so adorable. Well, that's too, too much. Yeah. Elvis schedule. is leaving. He's yeah. done. Yeah. Okay. So that doesn't I have those table yeah. raises from yeah. my bed to make yeah. the tires. Yeah. 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 Many uses. Okay. Cool. Joe's. Okay, Joe's. Boca. We're gonna pimp pimp mode. Pimp pimp mode. If you guys haven't subscribed to our gaming channel, go subscribe so you guys can see us game later, man. It's mostly me gaming. I game a little bit more than Didi. Didi does um always talking on it though. Hey, how can I help y'all? Uh, we have two dogs we would like to bring in. Okay. Walk in, see you guys. Yes, what are you only? What kind of dog? Uh, we have a Shih Tzu and a Chihuahua. 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 Shih Tzu
Okay. Yeah, I mean, we had a groomer and we just, she just didn't like the way that she did. You didn't like the haircut, maybe? Or someone no, haircut. I don't like that. I've got a click here. Oh, right. You can tell. Yes. That's funny, you know. Yes. The dog knows. My pit bull has so cheeks. Uh, Look up Pitbull Smiley on Google. It's adorable. <laughs> yeah, I've seen that. I've seen it like on a picture somewhere, like like maybe an Instagram or something. It's a Pitbull Smiley. All my animals are acting crazy. I'm further back in time on video trying to learn how to groom my Yorkie's face. I think... Um, so Buffy, we uploaded on best face trimming. I want to say it's like part two or three. That was a Yorkie, I think. It says best Yorkie trimming. One of the videos we recently uploaded, probably like less than a week ago. So that one will show you how to do the Yorkie's face if you don't get enough from this one. Uh, but there's a difference in my opinion. Yeah, three or four. Yeah. Like See, there's no other dog here. Now. Well, games we play, we can we play uh Fortnite, Black Ops, Tetris, Pac-Man. I'm looking for some more um fun games, but it's kind of hard to find some games. Minecraft. You know, I I should get duty into Minecraft. She might like it. Right, but it is just that. Eating the hearts, chicken, yum. So when like a clients, chicken heart, or what do you mean? Sunday first. Okay. That's the first appointment. It's the only Sunday I work for months. It's second Sunday. I book all the new clients that day. Okay. If we're good to go, do you like it? Do you like it? Don't like it? Then we require you to book a week A Saint Bernard. You know, uh, the requirement is because it's so hard to get in. No, so I don't really know. What, let me let me see. I'll let you know if Didi's ever. I have it, but. But I can let you know if Didi. Oh, whoa, that's a big dog. That's a big dog. <laughs> I have never seen Didi do one of those dogs. I think she did mention one time she did do a nail trim on one, but the only other time I've seen it was at one of her real estate meetings. There's a big old St. Bernard Lane. Laying on the floor, yeah, 200 pounds, big, bigger than me, man. Yeah, Yorkies are cute, man. They're, those are my favorite right there. Yorkies and Saki. A heart chicken restaurant? Um, no. no. Like eating a chicken's heart? I would assume that's healthy for you, I guess. <laughs> David, you work so hard. No, I don't work hard enough. Didi works way harder than me. I'm always slacking on it and she's always double timing it. What are you talking about? <laughs> oh, gosh, man. Like, right now, the day's over. I'm ready to go home, you guys. I'm ready. Uh, what are you talking about back there? He's talking to you, too. Like, you know, he's <laughs> working all double time. I'm always slacking. <laughs> I've never heard him say that out loud before. I'm like, that's so true. Uh, okay. Rabies, Harbo, December, which is, this is called DHPP. Do you have any grooming legato? Legato? A legato? Yeah, we, uh, are you talking about, uh, like the one that looks like a Portuguese water dog, Legato Ragamolo, or something like that. Legato Romangalo, Nolo, something like that. I, I, I don't recall how you say it, but um, it's kind of hard for me to say it. Um, we grew him one time. We had a client. If you go back and watch um, the videos, it's called um how to groom a oh, legato legato that's what it's called and mm, italiano legato legato i don't think so i'm gonna google it real quick see if it looks like the dog i'm talking about probably talking about the whole wrong dog 
the closest one we've grown was a legato. I don't think we get, yeah, legato. Yeah. We had one. He was brown. His, he was owned by Betsy. And he had a sister, which was his sister was a Portuguese water dog. And her name was Maggie. And the legato's name was Bruno. But they would always come in so mad because the parents lived at a lake or whatever. And they had their a, a pool and the dogs would always jump in the pool. And then they have curry hair. So they would get really, really mad at you. Guys, I'm not so a groomer, you man. Now, and just if you look and monitor monthly, you will see it starts to look different. Two, three years later, you're like, we got to get you in, right? Not every the sausage dog. <laughs> <'Cause you're, it's laughs> David Torres, I'm not a groomer, man. I don't know my breeds. But you talk to me about a car, I go look at a car, I know that car. But you t tell me dog breeds, I don't know them yet. I just like, yeah, yeah, I kind of do know them, but I know the typical ones that we get. Like, it's like asking me if we've ever gone like a, I don't even know what that, yesterday this the delivery guy was talking to me. And he was like, have you guys ever seen a, it was like a cho, um, something. So, let me look for it, see what it looks like. He's like, search this on, on, uh, on Google and you find it. It's called a Cholo. Let's to to Tilly, something like that. I'm like, dude, I, I don't know what kind of dog that is. I got no time. I never even heard of that. He's like, yeah, it's made in Mexico. It's a Mexican dog. I'm like, dude. Okay. <laughs> Exactly why I didn't say about grooming. It was a movie. Uh, what movie are you talking about? Beth Beethoven? I never watched that movie, man. I didn't really watch movies. I was more into um, cartoons. Cartoon. I know what movie you are. I do. I do know what movie that is. But I never watched it. So lucky because like that one thing, like that one. Uh, I remember watching this thing on PBS Kids that was um, a dog that used to talk. I don't remember. It was a white dog with like the the dot right here. The dot on the eyeball, like the black black thing right there. I don't remember what cartoon. Uh, well, no, it was in a cartoon, but it was a real person. Like, I mean, a real dog, like real people. You know. Yeah, Spock. Wishbone, there you go. Yeah, that one. I used to watch that one, but I really didn't like it. So it wasn't really so realistic. kind of hard to tell. I mean, we were... You're fired. Bro, I'm not even... I've never been hired. Husky. I'm just gonna so say I'm water, about 30. It rains, even if it, your own backyard, okay? When it rains, water travels. And it brings it in your neighbors. It was stuff. about it reading. Was it was. It was we yes, that one. Mexican dog. Hairless Mexican dog. But when I looked it up, the guy was like, um, 
It's a Mexican dog with a mohawk. I'm like, I looked it up. It's a hairless dog, man. Where you get a mohawk from? Look at the shirt, bitch. I got four pit bulls, and nice, egg and nice. Yeah, watching her. Really? We got four pit bulls now? No. No, we had that. The breeds of our dogs. It's going to be. Um, Faith is a Minpin Chihuahua mix. Faith is a Minpin Chihuahua mix. Minpin Terrier Chihuahua mix, and Saki is a. Uh, She's a chihuahua, and brownie, we're not sure about brownie yet. Didi says maybe he has, um, I don't know, I don't even want to say, but he's a chihuahua, some type of chihuahua, we don't know. We're going to do a DNA on him, probably. Dana, hi. We had a, um, great day. What kind of dog is that, you guys? You guys are giving me like these weird dogs, man. We're, um, hmm. Like a. Uh, kind of like a sheep dog uh, or something like that. Never uh, seen one of those. No, they, I don't think he's ever done one of those like that I've seen. She might have in her whole career, but I've seen never. You gotta remember we're in Texas, you guys. We, we did Texas dogs. <laughs> Brownie is all American dog. No, January 13th. Betsy hair on their heads. Bo, do this. Do me a favor. Do that. Work on that. Brownie looks like a chihuahua pug. Are you serious? Hmm. Okay. I think he was saying like chihuahua lab, like he had some lab in him. Dude, what did you say the other day that Brownie might have in? Oh, I think he has Lab, Shih Tzu, and Chihuahua. Lab, Shih Tzu, and Chihuahua. That's what Didi thinks. I think he has yeah. Lab, Shih Tzu, and Chihuahua because he acts like a horse. He walks around like a stallion. Yeah, he walks around with like his butt up and his like kicking like up the dirt. Like he's a like, show stallion. Like, not, like, like that, like kicking up the dirt like that. <laughs> he's and like he's got hooves. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, like kicking up the dirt. <laughs> and when he runs on the grass, man, the dirt's off kicking everywhere like this. <laughs> It is. Yeah, it is. That's funny that you noticed that. It's like he uses his nails. He does. <laughs> okay, what's going on? We got work to do, man. Yeah, I was just uh, I was just uh, talking to him, but you can finish out. No, I mean, don't leave, but what's up? What's Go up? Ahead. I was just keeping them company. Keeping your guys company. Were you having fun with David? Nah, judging they don't want to watch me bathe, they'll probably rather watch the groom. <laughs> I just got done talking to some new client potentials. They walked in. They wanted to get some prices. They had been going down to a salon that they said was named Paparazzi. And when they pulled up, the dog Shih Tzu. No, uh, they pull, would pull up and the dog, she said, the dog don't want to go there. Something They don't like it. That's something the dog's telling oh, yeah, them. And I said, I'm glad you're paying, paying attention yeah. to that. You but know? dogs are like that, man. Like a lot of dogs don't want to come in here and we, we record it. I can't say and... that a lot of dogs don't want to come in, but they do. Some some, dogs some talk, sometimes they do do that. They are pulling it back a little so bit like, or whatever. We don't, we don't really do it. We, I mean, we treat these dogs like kings here man i wouldn't say kings we treat them pretty good because I, I i don't i wouldn't health wise and focus on grooming yeah i wouldn't say that they get pampered and i don't know you know what i mean i'm not sure what definition king is but i focus on the work i get them done quickly we are firm direct and exactly they don't have to they hardly ever have to step in a cage they hardly ever have to step in a cage they, it's true one hour is like in and out rapid but I can hear groomers saying, you're too fast. You're too harsh and rough on these dogs. I hear it. Well, what's rougher? Them sitting in the cage for five hours and sitting with the dryer already dried and drying their face out and their eyeballs and their mouth. and Or or is, is us trying to get them out fast rougher? I don't know. I think them being in the cage is rougher than... Rougher on all their organs Anything, and their yeah. mind. Mm-hmm. 
dog sense things. You all are great, really great with them. I appreciate it. Uh, I'm not trying to fluff any feathers. So they went down the road. Well, they've been going to another groomer. They said uh, they they said their story was I'm not making this up. I don't like talking about false information, but I guess something happened and the dog has just gotten to a point where the dog does not want to go into that facility. So they need to switch groomers. We talked a little bit about vaccinations there with Banfield, which means there's all these things required that Banfield gives to them. So I said, hey, my recommended opinion is not to have the free or the included dental cleaning every year. I think that, you know, go in when you need to go in. It doesn't need to be every year. Um, we talked a little bit about vaccinations and they said, oh, we know. We, I said, do you think your dogs have all these? And they were like, oh, yeah, we got Banfield and we already been through it. And I said, what, you've been through Parvo? He goes, yeah, we've been through Parvo. We almost lost our Chihuahua. And I said, well, you already know. Uh, their dog got Chihuahua at two weeks old, two weeks after they got the dog. I don't know how old the dog was. So they bought this Chihuahua or got it. And two weeks later, they live in an apartment. They don't know where the dog picked it up. The dog got Parvo. It, it made it. Everything. She said 24 hour watch. She called her brothers. Everybody was tag teaming to make sure this dog got medicine all hours of the day and night. And the dog survived. So Parvo is real and you can pick it up at an apartment. You can pick it up outside, anywhere, uh, inside, anywhere. You know what I mean? You don't know someone who lived in the house prior to you. I can't tell you, but it's serious. So they understand vaccinations. They said, yes, we'll text you uh, right away all the vaccination records to get in. So a lot of talking right there, man. So I heard you say that you're a slacker. What happened? Where did that come from? Yeah, I'm a slacker, man. No, you work pretty hard. I just I just work longer hours and beep, beep. More, more physical toll. Totally. I'm a beep, beep. I wish he could groom. Beep. I would totally stop grooming. Beep. If I, I've offered it out, Sandra in Arizona, I I'm gave her an opportunity if we, recently. If we had enough time, I would learn how to groom, but uh, we, we don't have enough time, you guys. We're, we, right now, we're going to take a Slam. quick break, and we're going to be at home gaming tonight. I mean, that's our choice, but that's how that's Lee where Rally. our time. You guys know where we spend our time, our core. Lee Rowley, what? You guys are Again? awesome, man. Donate, don't donate a dollar, you guys. Everyone donate a dollar, and and then it adds up, man. One dollar, ninety nine cents. Ninety nine cents would be a fee charge of what though? Probably fifty percent of that. Ninety nine cents. I think we get seventy. Set. I don't know. I don't know exactly. I don't know, man. I don't, don't know exactly I don't know. either. D is alpha. Alpha, alpha. Stop bowing. You're not in Asia, man. We do that I'm in Taiwan. I'm not bowing. I'm praising you. Alpha. Give me my pin back. Alpha. Why is he, why is he holding on to my pin while he's walking around doing nothing? Alpha. What? Did you see his this pin? He was holding my pin for that whole 30 minutes. I gave you two of these pins. Where are they? This we one, where are they? We came at about Don't change the subject. eight to nine o'clock, you guys. This but, pin, uh, I found this pin from my um You keep taking it from my car, woman. My sister's husband's mom. And I, I'm gonna tell you, this is my favorite pin. If you want one, I'll put them on the website. These are my freaking favorite pins now. And you know where they're made? I wanna see make sure here before I say anything. Oh, actually, what? You won't believe where they're made. In the USA. I swear it said Japan. Uh, the last one I looked at. But I'm wrong. These are made in 